SGC here and we are back for first impression. Lost in Space 2013. Lost in Space 2018 edition. Season 1, episode 1. So if you didn't know, this is a reimagining of the 1965 series of the same name, which itself is a reimagining of the 1812 novel, The Swiss Family Robinson. And it follows the adventures of a family pioneering space colonists whose uh, ship veers off course. This originally was created by Erwin Allen, and this series is developed by Matt Sizema and Burke Sharpless, who is concerningly the people famous for, or best known for, writing Dracula Untold, The Last Witch Hunter, and Gods of Egypt. So, anyways, so we have Toby Stevens, Molly Parker, Maxwell Jenkins, Taylor Russell, Mina Sudwell, Ignacio Serencio, Parker Posey. Anyone else, check down below. So, as a first episode, full disclaimer, I actually enjoyed the film that came out back in 98, directed by Stephen Hopkins and starring William Hurt, Matt LeBanc, Gary Oldman. I actually dug it. I actually rewatched that a lot as a kid because I was like, whoa, this is crazy. But anyways, so Toby Stevens, who I've seen in Black Sails and also Molly Parker, who's in House of Cards. So I actually had expectations or sort of hopes to just see what they're gonna do because I think definitely Black Sails I haven't finished House of Cards I've seen what she's done so I want to see just her range and everything and everyone else I haven't seen before so that's always a breath of fresh air so visually enjoyed it and I was sort of that was my expectation I wasn't sure how the family dynamics were gonna be and all that and also it's different from the 98 movie already the dynamics of the family and I, I enjoyed it. I think the biggest thing for me was just the family element of the first episode. We have the crash and then the parents are sort of like, just gotta do their thing. And then the kids have to step up and then things, and then the factors of risk and danger are there. And then we got the robot and it's different from what I saw in the 98. And I'm definitely thinking it's different from the original too. And it's also, Great, I, I enjoyed it. Though the doctor thing at the end, the whole like switch bait of identity, I wonder how that's gonna play out. I'm not really digging her, whatever was shown about her, but the family, I enjoyed it. Just the foiling of the characters and just their chemistry, I really wanna see how they're gonna survive on this planet and what they're gonna do. And so yeah, I, I'm excited and pumped. And uh, Toby Stevens and Molly Parker play good, parents in a sense and I like how there was so much hidden conflict between the two of them in front of their kids and it's just you see the building of this family in the beginning as they're like trying to Toby Stevens off in the military and he gets back and he's like a family and then you're like oh they're on this trip together so it must be great but then slowly unraveling of like the reveal of what is this family really about really enjoy that and yeah visually I think it's looking pretty expensive so I wonder if there will be a dip in quality throughout the season because it looks pricey but overall I enjoyed the visuals enjoy the family dynamics so yeah I can't wait to see what the rest of the season is gonna hold in terms of the family dynamics how they're gonna patch up the relationships and what this doctor and those two engineers are gonna do with the with whatever they're doing and the robot was cool cool robot design love that so yeah i can't wait to uh watch the rest of the season and come back with final impressions so that's it for this first impression of lost in space season one episode one out <laughs>